Hey guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Today we're going to talk about how to save a OneNote from your OneDrive to your local computer. And this is a little bit tricky because when you go into your OneDrive, you can see these are my OneDrive folders and I go to my OneNotes folder. Okay, there should be some OneNotes in here that you've made up if you're watching this right now. But if I click on the circle on the left of the file and I try to download it, the download button disappears. So what they're saying is you can only open the OneNote, but there's no way to save it. Okay, so how would you save a OneNote from the uh, OneDrive to your computer? Okay, so this is how we do it. So you're going to click on the circle next to your OneNote, you're going to click on open, open in OneNote. Okay, so we're going to click on open OneNote and you'll see that it then opens up the OneNote in a OneNote app. Now it's very important which app you open it in because if you open it in the OneNote for Windows 10 app, then it won't let you do what I'm about to do. So to make sure that you are opening in the correct app, you need to go to default apps on your Windows and you need to make sure that you go down to uh, set default defaults by app. Okay, and then you need to make sure that you go down to OneNote, uh, OneNote, okay, so not OneNote for Windows 10, just the OneNote. It could say OneNote 2016 depending on how old your computer is, but not OneNote for Windows 10, okay, just OneNote. Click Manage and make sure that all of these files are associated with OneNote as the default, okay? If you have this, then it will not work. It needs to just say OneNote. Okay, so back to opening it up in this app. To now then save this to your computer, all you have to do is you're gonna right click on your OneNote, then you're gonna click on Properties, and you can see the location is currently on your OneDrive. So all you have to do is click on change location. Click on change location and then go somewhere on your desktop. And you're just going to save it in here. So you're going to click select. And it says your notebook is now syncing to the new location. So if you click OK. Okay, and now if you minimize everything and go to your desktop, go to your desktop. Okay, go to your desktop and you can see that it's created a folder with the same name as your OneNote. And if you go in there, there are your OneNotes. Okay, this whole folder is your OneNote, your sections and double click on this and it'll open it up in OneNote. And if you want to copy this to another computer, all you have to do is you're going to right click on this folder, click copy, and you, you can paste it to your um, flash drive or portable hard drive or whatever it is you call this. So I'm going to plug this into my computer and I'm going to paste it in my hard drive. Okay, so now this notebook is now on my hard drive and then I can take this out and then I can now plug this hard drive into another computer with OneNote 2016 and open it. Okay, so let's pretend that I'm on my new computer now because I'm not going to bring out another computer just for this, but let's say I plug this into my new computer Okay, and on your new computer, you will go to your this PC and open up your 
portable hard drive and then you're gonna search for the folder double click on that and you're just gonna have to click on open notebook dot one uh, basically it's a OneNote table of contents file double click on that and it'll open up on your new computer okay alternatively you could also uh, copy this whole folder copy the fitness folder into another location on your new computer and then open it up okay thanks for watching guys see you next time thanks for watching guys see you next time